Okay, paid off my fine, so that's good. Uh, God, that's <clears throat> thousand bucks. That's a hard pill to swallow. That's that freaking that sucks, man. Thousand dollars sucks. All right, guys, it's Friday. It has been a super busy week. I hope that you all have plenty of toilet paper. Um, <clears throat> I found two boxes yesterday, two, two packages yesterday on my way home. So we have plenty to last us at least a month. Um, not trying to be part of that crowd, but also I do not want to use the restroom without toilet paper. That's, I know that there's other ways to get clean. That's just what I've done my whole life is use toilet paper and I wanted to keep it up. So I'm not trying to add to the chaos, um, but I did. I bought toilet paper. And the heat and air guy that came to my house today fixed my heat and air system. Super thankful, super blessed that he came and did that. Um, he said the guy in Tulsa is already better. So, gonna go do, uh, gotta go pay a fine down at OREC from 2016. Not happy about that. Um, did a teacher gift card giveaway trying to help out teachers and teacher supply closets and things of that nature. And uh, the commission at that time said I was doing a lottery and I got fined. And I, and I don't want to have to go pay it, but they sent me the invoice finally on it. So I'm going to go downtown and pay it right now. And then we're going to shoot a 3D tour on the new listing in Edgemere Park. And I'm super stoked about that. 1,700 square feet, beautiful remodel in Edgemere Park. If you're in the market for a new home and you want to live in the most hot part of Oklahoma City, you've got to check out this 3D tour. I'll have the links in the comments below as soon as it finishes processing. Um, I go shoot the tour and then I wait till I get home to upload the tour because I've got Giga Blast internet. I got the Cox Giga Blast internet. So that's why it takes me a while to get it uploaded. I don't try to upload it through my phone. I have unlimited data, but there's no reason to use such a slow data plan. And then by the time I get home, I'm halfway in the upload and then the iPad switches over to my home internet and it starts to process over. So I just wait till I get home and it's done pretty instantaneously. Um, hope you guys are getting ready for Shabbat. Hope you guys are ready to Sabbath, especially after this crazy week of everything that's going on. Amy's going to a closing today. She closed on that condo, so we'll circle dial that next week. Let everybody know that we just sold it. And it sold, I think, in less than two weeks. So super excited to spread the news on that and let people know that. Um, yeah, guys. I will uh, use my phone. I better start charging it right now. I'll use my phone to get some uh, shots of me doing the uh, 3D tour on the property so you guys can enjoy that. And then like I said, I'll put the comments, I'll put it down in the comments below the actual tour. Uh, I used the Insta360 One X to do my 3D tours. Would I recommend that camera? The battery gets too hot for me. The battery gets hot, the system shuts down on transfer sometimes when I'm transferring a large amount of data. I wouldn't be able to recommend that um, that camera and and I've used two different batteries. I have two different batteries, so there's something wrong with the camera, or they're just not telling us that this happens when you're transferring a large amount of data. Which, if that's the case, that's really annoying. They so I I trusted so many YouTubers' advice on this camera. I I thought I researched it well, but I'm just I'm just not happy with it. So, anyways. Josh Barnett, Better Homes and Garden, Real Estate Paramount, Oklahoma's listing agent. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next clip. Okay, I, where's this at?
Come on. Ah, wrong one. I paid off my fine. Okay, paid off my fine. So that's good. Uh, that's <clears throat> thousand bucks. That's a hard pill to swallow. That freaking that sucks, man. Thousand dollars sucks. Uh, so upset right now. Could have bought diapers. For three months with that. Anyways, let's change our mind. Let's change our mindset. Let's put it behind us. Let's go shoot that virtual tour on the property in Edgemere Park. Let's start promoting that. Let's get some new business. Make that money up quick by helping people find their perfect homes. That's what that's what we're gonna do. That's how we're gonna turn around our mindset, and that's how we're gonna attack the rest of the day. So, um, let's go to Edgemere Park, and let's go look at that home. I'll see you guys on the next clip. Wow, 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 guys. Check out this neighborhood. These old houses are awesome. These are some awesome old houses. This is where they run the uh, marathon. They run the marathon up this street, too. Wow, that's a colonial. Wow. These are great. These are really great houses. Oh, man. Turn it on the Do Not Disturb because I don't want people ringing in while we're doing the tours and things of that nature. Um. Where does this thing want me to go? Why is this happening? Okay. Um. Yeah, they run the marathon up and down this street. So, that's crazy. Come on, minivan. Thank you. Checking out the GPS here. I'm trying to see where I'm supposed to go. Oh, we're gonna go down that street. Okay. Okay, perfect. Here we go. The owner of that building right there tried to uh, do some stuff on it, and then these people who don't own it tried to register it as a historic land, uh, historic landmark. So people who don't even own that property tried to impose their feelings on the owner of the property and force that owner to not mess with the building. How crazy is that? The people think they could just push their opinions and thoughts on another property owner because of their feelings. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. I'm pretty sure that gentleman uh, won and he's now able to do what he wants to his own property but that was super ridiculous that he even had to put up with that BS why don't those people pay his taxes why don't those people pay his utilities you know if, they're, if their feelings are so obscured that they think that he should do what they want why aren't they paying for his expenses and cost you know people nowadays man this is a cool neighborhood really cool neighborhood wow 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 almost there guys almost there man this is so cool this is so cool Alright guys, there it is right there. Uh, my investor buddy that buys houses and sells them and fixes them up, remodels, remodels them and makes neighborhoods nice and all that other stuff. This is another one of his projects that I can't wait to show you guys. So, let's go in here and take a look at this place. This is going to be really nice. I'm super excited. 
and we'll be shooting the uh, 3D tour at the same time too. So I'm excited about that also. I um, don't see my other tripod. I got my monopod, but I need my tripod too. So, all right, I'll see you guys on the next clip. All right, guys, we are here in Edgemere Park. We're in the newest listing for the uh, for this area. This is a complete remodel. So here you've got the gas stove, and it's a six burner gas stove. And like I said, this is a complete remodel. So everything is new. It has the open concept, as you can see. And if you're just kind of following along with me on the YouTube, then uh, I just did a circle so you can see how big of a open floor plan it is. So you've got two entrances here in the front, which is really nice. You can uh, go on that patio or the other patio. And then you've got this amazing remodeled half bath. Let me show you that right there. How about that? That's a pretty nice feature. You've got this beautiful count, this beautiful island here in the middle. This wondrous and large, this large dining area right here. You've got inside utilities for a home of this age, built 1920. That's something you don't really find. You've got inside laundry room. How nice is that? You've got your microwave right down there and check out that sink. Is that not the coolest sink that you've ever seen? You've got a beautiful bath that's been completely remodeled. This whole home, this whole home is completely remodeled, folks. If you're wanting to live down in Edgemere Park, you've got to see this property. Give me a call, 405-315-7965. Josh Barnett with Better Homes Garden Real Estate Paramount. I would love to show you this complete remodel. Look at this master. Is this master just not beautiful? And look at the finishes that they've done here on the shower, the bath. I mean, look at all that storage in that linen closet up there. Is that not just the coolest thing? And then we've got two more guest bedrooms. So it's a three bed, two and a half bath home in Edgemere Park. Folks, you're gonna wanna see this property. This is a one of a kind property, a huge backyard, lots of parking. You're, if you're in the market for a new home in Oklahoma City, give me a call, 405-305-7965. These old historic homes like this don't last long, and being completely remodeled, just wow, wow, wow. All right, folks, give it a big thumbs up, share it with all your friends. Thanks so much for touring this home with me, and I'll see you on the next clip. Okay, 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 okay. All right, just got uh, my check from the office and I went ahead and deposited it just in case the Fed's down or something. Uh, Want to make sure that that is already deposited. I mean, it's not gonna do anything right now. You know, it's not gonna show up into my account till Tuesday, but at least I got the ball rolling on that. That is important. I, I usually deposit checks like once a week, every other week, when I pick them up. But I got the check from the office and deposited it right then. <laughs> oh man, crazy stuff, crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. So, uh, did that 3D tour, which I'll put the link in the comments below on that amazing remodel in Edgemere Park. And I shot well, I'm always shooting on 360, but I shot a 360 walkthrough on it that I'll, it'll be in this video that you're watching today because you're a real estate 
daily subscribers, and uh, and I appreciate you guys so much. You, you just you can't like the the liking the videos, the sharing the videos. I appreciate that so much, and the questions on real estate, I love answering them. Uh, I should really appreciate that. But uh, I'll also upload that walkthrough as just a walkthrough video too. And then I'll be able to target add it, target do a targeted ad to that area of town on YouTube, which I'm really excited about. I cannot wait to do that, actually. Super excited. I'm putting on my blinkers right now so people know that everybody's slowing down. Yeah. I hope you guys had a great week. I hope you guys get ready to Shabbat with your families and you know spend time with Yah. Thank him for Yeshua. Thank you for the sacrifice that Yeshua made to save us from sin. Um, thanks for watching the video, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me this week. As always, you got questions about real estate, put them in the comments below. Um, I'll see you guys on the next clip. Have a good one.